It is the Art Show on Near FM on 90.3. Robbie Kane here with you, and I'm absolutely delighted to be joined in the studio by the Cosmic Machine. Hello, guys. How's it hey. going? Thanks for coming in. Now, you're going to sing a song for me. Yeah. This is our new song from our latest album, which we're releasing next week, and it's called True Blue. I cannot wait to hear it. Take it away. Oh, guys, that was brilliant. Well done. Fantastic. So soulful. Loved it. That's going to be number one on the track. Track one. Side one. Limited edition. I cannot wait to hear this. Thanks a million. Listen more from the band The Cosmic Machine after this short break. Hello. What are you doing here? I need your help. Seriously. I've got a really important interview with a major media company. And why do you need my help? <laughs> you haven't, have you? Again? Oh, Melanie, you are such a tool! Elaine, can I borrow your shoes, please? I have a very... Uh, no please. way! I have two posh gits coming in after lunch, so I actually am. Where are my best shoes today, so no! After lunch? Sure, I'll be back by 11. Come here, are Ronnie and Josie in the studio? Yeah, but you can't go in. Yeah, I know I can't go in. I'm not a gobshite. I did get her the interview, you know. Elaine, come on, shoes. I said no. Now stop acting like a crazy cunt because you're bringing down the town of the place. You know what, Elaine? Ma told me to never tell you this. But you actually weren't born. You know that? You were created in a lab using unwanted cells from obscure creatures. You were an experiment that went wrong. Come on now, Melanie. Some of us actually have real jobs to do. Okay. No. no. Get away from me. Get away Melanie, from me. Melanie, I said no! Melanie, your shoes! Melanie, Melanie, you have to stop leaving stop. your shoes on the Lewis! No. Get the... Oh, I'm telling Ma. Look, I'll be back by midday, all right? I'm sorry. No, I'm going to kill you, Melonhead! Well, I must say, Melanie, this is very impressive. Oh, please, it's Mel. Well, thanks very much. It's been many years. I can see that. Oh, how was that, that gig? Yeah, weren't they absolutely brilliant? Amazing. And amazing images. You've got a good eye. Thank you. Pretty are we for you? Thank you so much for coming out. This documentary is so close to my heart. With over 10,000 men, women, and children registered as homeless here in Ireland, this documentary and others like it need to be made until this problem is solved. I myself was homeless for a year, sleeping rough. Rent skyrocketed and there was nothing I could do. And if it wasn't for my beautiful friends, Josie, Mel, thank you so much, you saved me. I, I would still be out there. And if it wasn't for this beautiful man, my rock, John, this documentary would never have been made. So, thank you. Yeah, you really know who your friends are in hard times. And homelessness is an issue that needs to be resolved. Sleeping in the streets or in your car is the most lonely and humiliating feeling in the world. So thanks to everyone for showing up. Uh, a few of our friends couldn't make it, sadly, but there you are.
daytime screenings. <laughs> uh, we'd also love it if, if you join us for a few drinks. Thank you. Bad news with that ex of his hanging around. Not like the kids are out and she needs to fuck right off. I just feel like an idiot. He never told me. You know, I am an open-minded Californian. You both know that, but this shit's weird, man. It is weird. And women like her are dangerous. Dangerous? No, she's lovely. Yeah, that's why she's dangerous. Oh, the super cool ex who's now his maid? Fuck that! Just keep it down, Josie. He's right over there. He can hear us. Yeah. Oh, no, don't look behind you now. What are you doing? Shite balls, man. Now he's coming over. Nice one. Hey, Josie, isn't it? Hey, yeah. Uh, didn't see you over there. How's it going? Lovely to see you here. You know Ali? Yeah. Yeah, the three of us share a house in Somerville Avenue in Dublin. Wow. Never knew that. Not far from me, so. Uh, Mel, this is Dom. Dom, Mel, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Mel. And what is it you do? I'm a photojournalist and I make videos too. <sighs> so much talent in one house. I must pay a visit. Yeah, but we're never there ever. Sure we're not. Well, weekends we are. Mm. I'm going to the bar to get a drink. Can I get you ladies anything? No, yeah, thanks. Grand, thank you. Um, I'll have a, another glass of white wine, please. That is an excellent choice. I'll be back in a sec. Nice one, thanks. What the fuck is wrong with you? What have I done? Ali, how the fuck do you know him? He's a driver on our documentary. How do you know him, Josie? <sighs> Shut up, I don't want to talk about it. I think he's a bit all right. Yeah, you would. You would piss in your cornflakes. Why don't you want to talk about Dom? Just leave him now. Did you fight him? Yeah, I did. Look, it was a long time ago after I broke up with Mick. It was just a crazy rebound thing. It meant nothing. I'll tell you one thing. He's a handsome fucker. He had this weird fetish of a woman walking on him. I mean him lying on the ground and stuff. That sounds fucking painful. Yeah. And did you? Yes, I did. Well, what happened then? I broke my whole right arm. That's what happened to your arm? Yeah. So there was no car crash? No. Why didn't you just say? Would you? The <laughs> fuck no. I hope Aunt Nula doesn't get up to her old tricks again, Mel. I'm not able. The last time she stayed, the dog ate the sofa. Yeah, and she jumped into bed with Ali's ex, Billy Smith, lying drunk. What's wrong with the car? Josie? Are I here? Fuck. I knew I should have gone to the garage. Are you serious? You're gonna have to get out and push. Push? On my own? I'm not damaging me womb. Well, it's either damage the bag or we're gonna stay here all night. I can't fucking believe this. I can't believe push it. it. Just start it up push there, it. will you? Feel eyes on us. It's probably just a wild animal no. or something. My instincts are never wrong. Let's just look for a train or something, yeah? What about my car? Well, can you afford a mechanic? No, I can barely afford the car. Right, well, we can't stay here unless we want to be kidnapped and sold to men in caves or something. What? Just get a bag, get the valuables, and let's... Look, no one will be able to start it. Come on, Josie, I'm not staying here. I'm not going to believe this. Bullshit. Where is everyone? Oh, so you do have a problem with Masha? No, I just... 
Oh, look, Addy, I'm really not in the mood for this jealousy. Oh, I am not jealous. You are literally wearing the shirt that she was wearing this morning. Look, can we not just have a good time and, like, celebrate the screening, no? You don't think it's strange that she literally lives in your house and does your chores like a little wifey? Look, Masha is a great friend of mine. And, look, nothing else has gone on between us, so... If you want to think that there is, well, then there's nothing I can do for you. Are you excited for the hotel this evening? John? Are you seriously giving me the silent treatment right now? Oh, this is gonna be fun. I should have left with Mel and Josie. Last train to Dublin is, please. Last train to Dublin left an hour ago. Next one is at 7 o'clock in the morning. What? No, no. No, 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 no. I got a train here before. The last train is at 8 p.m. Nope. Last train is 7 p.m. Well, then what are you still doing here? Trains running until 10 o'clock to Wicklow. What are we going to do now? Go to Wicklow? Um, sorry. Are there any coaches going to Dublin anytime soon? Doubt it. Coach services around here finishes at half seven. Taxis? We can get a taxi to Donna's. She lives around here somewhere. Go, send her and I'll text her. Taxi rank is about an hour's walk from here. We need a taxi to get there. <laughs> Car hire, please. Yeah, the taxi rank. So, are we just stuck here, are we? Is there anywhere we could just go and have a little sit down and a cup of coffee or something like that? Not too many places around here. There is one close to where the taxi rank is. Right, what's the name of it? The Warm Welcome. It's a nice place. It used to be a funeral home. Oh, lovely. Well, what if I could get a taxi here to collect us? Yeah, just like a normal taxi. Yeah. They don't do call outs, they only walk from the rank. We're wasting our time standing here. Let's start walking, okay? Yeah, um, where is the taxi rank, please? When you leave the station, take a right. Keep going until you come to a river. This gets better. Walk over the bridge, then you see the opening to a big park. Walk through the park. Then you'll see an ancient castle, one of those old haunted ones. Beautiful. Just to the left of that, could stop walking at 9 p.m. though. Why 9 p.m.? No one's out at that time looking for taxis. Ah, uh, here. Just wasting our time talking yeah. to this. Is just, just you're ignorant, you know that. You're really rude. It is. Yes. Don't you fucking have a new bag? Put my clothes back into my iron. Don't you have an iron in your car? Because oh. I iron with things in my car. You sometimes. iron. You iron when you dry it. Okay, very safe. Yeah, iron when I dry it. What? Who's ironing? Directions were shouting you in. I mean, I can hear a river somewhere. Well, hopefully, we get a river. Right you are? Yes. Oh. What are you doing? What's wrong with you? Shit. What did you do? My leg. Mel, my leg. Which oh, one? This, this one? one, my right leg. Oh, God. Is it sprained? I don't know. I can't move it. Ah! Uh, how are you doing, man? What are you doing? Uh, you'll have to take the boot off. It's going to swell okay. up. Okay, will you help me, please? I'll have to take your boot off, Okay, right? take it off, right. please. Just, just get it off, off me. Oh, oh, hang down! Oh. 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 Is it glued on? Is it glued? Just take the fucking thing off me! Uh. Mel! Oh, I'm trying to fucking... Jesus Christ! I'm too fucking well. I'm, I'm 
bollocks. Do you know what? I'm too tired for this. Yeah, we're stranded in the middle of nowhere. Josie, I see a garage. No, you don't see a I garage, Mel. Do. I see a garage. Are you I sure? Do. I do. I see a garage. I actually see a garage. Quick. Right, Are on, you on. right in the head? No, no. Come on. Come on. Hold on. Come on. Come on. Oh. Oh. Where's your boo? There! Oh, fuck's sake. Oh, yeah, it's man. definitely a garage, look. I hope it is, Mel. Fuck's sake. Shit. You're gonna end up carrying me. Mel, me hold. Don't give me a jockey back or something. Hold. Give me a jockey back. So rude to me, Mel. Jesus, hate. Josie, why do you have so much shite in your car? No wonder we're packed in. Mel, I actually think that's fractures. Sluts. Sorry. You talk to us. Dirty whores. Just leave it, she's a bit wacky. Look at you. Women of the night. Should be ashamed of yourselves. Shut that hole in your face, love. Yeah. Melanie, leave it. <laughs> Selling yourselves. Selling yourselves to rotten men. Ugh. Dirty, filthy whores. Straight to hell you'll go. State of you. Taking off your boot. Slut. Okay. Listen, we're going to be going out of here in two minutes. Back off! Too tired for this, do you know that? Your leg's killing me. Donna hasn't seen me text. What about my car? My car be grand. She'll no one find it. To be honest, no one will steal it. Thanks. You know what I mean? No! You smell of filthy men. Oh, fuck's sake. Come on, let's get out of here before she starts beating us with a cross or something. Oh, great. There goes two taxis, shite. S-C-U-M. Just help me up this chair. Burn in hell for what you're doing. That's it. Go on. Go. Out of here. Dirty whores. Dirty, filthy whores. You all right? Go on. I can't cope with her. Out of here. I wandered around here. Keep going. Go on. Dirty, filthy whores. Rotten hell for what you're doing. Dirty women of the night. My fuck. What now? It's Mick. Fuck it is. Oh my God, he broke my heart. I mean, he broke my heart. Do you want to go off to him? See if he's going back to Dublin or something? No, look at me standing here with one shoe on the head of me. He still has a righty face though. Josie, I'm not being funny or anything, but we need to get back. Your foot is fucked. To be honest with you, so am I. Come on, use your charm. Come on. Mick! Josie. Hey, how's it going? How are you? Yeah. How are you? Good. Uh, why do you only have one boot on? <laughs> I fell and sprained my ankle earlier and Mel took my boot off gently. How are you, Mel? Mick? So, what has you two all the way out here? My car broke down, now we're stranded. It's been a nightmare of a day. I'm trying to get back to Dublin. Do you still live in Dublin? No, we live out here now. Anyway, your man said that there's loads of taxis, yeah. so we're just going to wait one over there somewhere. No, no. Jump in. No, we can't no. do that, Mick. No. Go on, jump in, I'll drop you back to Dublin. Are you sure? Yeah. I'm going to go in and pay for this before they close. Jump in. We'll pay you back and everything. Oh, you better. Stone warnings on the radio ground. SOS distress signals from the archipelago to the mainland. Mountains tumbling into the sea. Phone lines open up so deep you can hear the devil breathe. Signals 
Righteous path you walk in. Righteous path you walk in. 